get it wrong. How did you know this? I didn't know at all. If War Dogs wasn't a true story, we wouldn't believe it. A couple of young guys turn a little-known government initiative on its ear to the tune of $300 million. Jonah Hill and Miles Teller are perfect as the 20-somethings who get a little too greedy. And Hangover director Todd Phillips certainly knows about guys making bad decisions. Frankly, we were a tad concerned with your performance history against a deal of this size. But after meeting you two face to face, we feel like we're in good hands on this one. We won't let you down, sirs. Not to mention your bid was far too attractive for us to pass up. What did you mean by that exactly? He means you boys lowballed the entire industry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, by how much? You guys came in $53 million lower than the nearest competition. Oh, okay. Now to a question that still has no clear answer. How did two 20-something young men land a $300 million Pentagon contract? What is this movie? How do you describe it? Well, it's, it's based on a true story, you know? Joan and I play these two characters. They, um, you know, are in their early 20s, living in Miami. We were best friends growing up. He moves away, he comes back into town. He presents kind of, you know, an opportunity. And, and uh, you know, they're really two kind of, like, low-grade hustlers that end up seizing an opportunity and kind of exploiting uh, some loopholes. And, you know, things, things spiral out of control. Well, and I think, too, with Todd Phillips being the director, He's done such amazing comedies. Um, so this is a little different for him. What was it like working with him, knowing that he'd come from the Hangover background and a lot of other different movies? It was great. You know, Todd's a really talented director, and he knew exactly what he wanted, you know, this movie to be, and I think he executed that really well. And, uh, you know, I'm always supportive of people that are ambitious to take a turn in their career or try something new and try and pivot, I think it's inspiring, you know, to not just do the same thing time and again and to really try and take chances. You got me, you got me. They call guys like us war dogs, bottom feeders who make money off of war without ever stepping foot on the battlefield. Show you about my it was meant to be derogatory, but we kind of liked it. We don't play fair. Sorry, Excuse kind me. of an emergency. Sorry, don't worry, I have to go first, I'm American. You seriously want to drive to Baghdad? David, we're gun runners. Let's go run some guns. Give me some of that. So a lot of people are saying this is something very different for Todd Phillips, but I mean, I'm thinking you got Vegas, there's a baby, and there's Bradley Cooper. <laughs> so, in, I know. I, That's I, funny, I was like, yeah. See? Right. But this is a little different oh, for, for you. Oh, for sure, yeah. This is a departure in tone, mostly, and like you said, it's a drama with some comedy in it. Um, it's based on a true story. Um, yeah, it, it's a little bit different for me. It's, it's an evolution, if you could say. It still has its feet in some of the stuff I've done before, mm -hmm. but it's kind of in a different direction. I love it when someone beats the system and then gets their comeuppance, one way or another. Check out War Dogs in your real-time theater.